other instances of Tom cheating on Ariana? Since the Raquel news broke, I've heard multiple things. Really? That now coming out of the Doubt came to the watch What Happens Live Clubhouse a few days after it was revealed that the former Vanderpump Rules star will compete on the upcoming Freebie reality series. The GOAT to talk about the debt ceiling. I'm joking, of course, the scandal. Her first appearance on Bravo since her contentious sacking back in 2020 was the guest slot. Since the explosive affair involving Tom Sandoval and Raquel Levice initially came to light, almost every cast member of Vanderpump Rules, except for the love triangle, has appeared on WWHL to share their opinions. The identical series of inquiries have been posed by host Andy Cohen each time. When did you learn about the relationship? Were you taken aback? Did you spot any warning signs? Have you ever heard of Sandoval's cheating? The 40-year-old had a fairly spicy response for the last query. Doubt. Sitting next to a perplexed Annalie Ashard remarked, since the Rockle news broke, I have heard of multiple things now coming out of the woodwork. Dude responded that she didn't personally know any of the women he is accused of having an affair with when Cohen pressed for further information. However, she said a buddy of a friend hooked up with him when he and Schwartz particularly were doing appearances together. During his guest appearance in March, Jax Taylor also implied that Sandoval was a frequent cheater. Dute, however, has the perspective of having been Sandoval's ex and a notorious cheater in the past. The former SUR employees worked between 2007 and 2014. The infidelity scandal that launched the program, which saw Doubt sleeping with Sandoval's former BF Taylor in season two, was the cause of their separation. In addition, Sandoval acknowledged having sex with Ariana Maddox while still dating Doot. Doubt made it plain on WWHL that she had moved past her troubled relationship with Maddox. The podcast host vehemently disagreed when Cohen questioned her on what she thought of followers who said that Maddox deserved to be cheated on because of what she did to Doubt. No. She answered. I got to say this, after all. Nobody else's viewpoint is relevant. The two are not equivalent. She wasn't deserving of it. Maddox and Doot have gotten along well lately. Even in the season 10 finale, Doot makes an appearance to console Maddox after the scandal. And it appears that the two are now close enough because Doot was present when Maddox found out about Sandoval and Levise's romance. During the performance featuring Tom Sandoval and the most extras, I was there the night the phone fell out of the pocket. Doubt recalled. I occupied the seat next to Ariana. Then she said, Ariana vanished. She was seated in the chair next to me with her phone and purse nearby. There were many fans present. I grabbed them, but it took me 20 minutes to locate her. I gave it to a friend of hers since I wanted to go and didn't speak to her again until Friday morning. Doubt and her former co-star Stassi Schroeder were sacked for a racist incident in which they sought to accuse a black lady, Faith Stowers, for a crime at 2020's Black Lives Matter rally. Given that Bravo is willing to re-platform Doot, even for a short time, they could have at least brought up the problem at hand. In general, the guest appearance was merely another attempt to salvage any drama that might still be left over from this never-ending story. The night's high point, if there was one, was when Doubt told Lisa Vanderpump to suck a dick during one of the games. Some things remain the same.